It is day five of the Russian invasion of Ukraine. Currently, all major Ukrainian cities remain under the control of the Ukrainian government. But intense fighting is underway in many parts of the country. Let's take a look at the latest Russian advance on Ukraine. As you can see, Moscow launched its attack from three main directions, the north, the south and the east. The areas marked in red on the map are where Russia has made gains over the last five days. However, the main battle is on for the Ukrainian capital of Kiev. A bulk of Russian forces still remain situated nearly 30 kilometers from the city. But analysts suggest the Russian progress has been slow, bogged down, some officials in the West claim, by rising disquiet about the conflict among the ranks. Ukraine says Russia's advance has been slowed by forces defending Hostomel airfield. According to the UK, logistical failures and staunch resistance are stalling the Russian advance. In Ukraine's second largest city, Kharkiv, there have been reports of heavy fighting, reports of street fighting and explosions in the city. But on Sunday, Ukraine said the Russian attack had been repelled. While major cities are still holding up, Moscow has made massive gains in the south of the country. Kiev acknowledging that the Black Sea city of Berdyansk had fallen, along with Kherson, located on the other side of Crimea. Currently, Moscow has now almost forged a corridor along the Black Sea, linking Crimea with Donetsk in the east, which is, of course, a rebel-held area. In Ukraine, more than 350 civilians have been killed, including 14 children. And Russia, for the first time, has acknowledged that it, too, has suffered losses. All of this comes as President Volodymyr Zelensky says the next 24 hours will be crucial for his country. Стреляли мы.